everybody. I am here to answer your guys' questions. I have 36 to answer. I'm gonna answer these in short form. How are you? Pretty good, thank you for asking. Overwhelmed, nervous, scared. I'm happy. I have a lot of emotions going on. I'm like emotionally exhausted. Why did Crystal break up with you? She broke up with me because she thought she fell out of love with me. The breakup was very two-way. I didn't want to be with someone who wasn't happy in a relationship, so we both agreed upon it. When are you moving? On July 2nd. Are you still going to continue your diet? Definitely continue my diet. Is there a deeper reason you've explained already as to why Crystal didn't want to be with you no more? People don't just fall out of love. There is not a deeper reason that is purely the reason she didn't feel like she was happy anymore and she didn't feel like she was in love with me anymore. Are you going to keep talking to Crystal's family? Most definitely, 110% yes. Have you been on track with your diet? No, I have not at all. I did weigh myself. I didn't gain any weight, which I find to be completely odd because I haven't been counting calories. I haven't been eating healthy. I haven't been drinking water. How did you meet your new girlfriend? She's not my girlfriend. She wants to ask me in person. Like, isn't that the cutest thing ever? Her name is Destiny. Crystal downloaded these like chat apps when we broke up. I kind of did it just because she was doing it. I didn't really care about things like that. And I was more so just like mourning our breakup. I talked to a lot of people on there. Everyone was really just boring, stupid, or perverted. And Destiny sent me a message and we got along really well. We became friends and I don't know what happened. Like we just formed a really, really strong connection. I'm so, so grateful for it. Can you please keep vlogging? I am really bad with vlogging lately. I literally have been doing nothing. I think it's mainly because when I get emotionally drained, it's hard for me to even function. It's really bad. I'm trying to get better. I've been trying to leave the house as much as possible. And even when I do leave the house, I just haven't been in the mood to vlog. It's very strange because vlogging is a really big part of my life. I really want to try to vlog again for you guys. I'm going to try. I promise. <laughs> Will you keep in touch with Crystal when you move? Yes. What does Crystal think of you moving? She's sad, which is to be expected. She says she's happy for me. When's your birthday? My birthday is December 27th, 1990, so I will be 25 this year. Please don't remind me. I am an old woman. Is Crystal in a new relationship also? No, I don't think so. She is talking to other people, but no one is really, like, interesting her as hard as, like, me and Destiny are. How is Crystal's family taking the new changes and what do they think about you moving? I was honestly so freaking scared to tell them I was moving. I thought they were going to be mad for some reason. They were extremely understanding. Way more understanding than I could ever even form in my head. They cried a lot. Crystal's parents cried a lot. We all cried. It was like a crying fest. We all became really close and I just don't think we noticed how close until we realized that I'm not going to be here one day and that one day is coming up very, very soon. They took it hard in the sense of like they're going to really miss me. I'm very grateful for everything they've done for me. I will always talk to them. They take up a big part of my heart. They're also very nervous for me and scared for me and worried. None of us really know what I'm going into exactly. Sometimes you have to take chances in life and just see how they work out, especially when you're young. You could more so regret not doing something than regret doing something because in the back of your head, you'll always have those, well, what if? I do not like what ifs. Has it been hard to sleep in the same bed as Crystal? Honestly, no. It hasn't. We just kind of lay there for like half an hour, watch TV, and then go to sleep. I normally face the wall. She faces this way. There's no riddle or rhyme to it. It's pretty simple. <laughs> are you going to get a job when you move? Yes, of course. How are you going to tolerate Florida heat and humidity when you barely can tolerate Virginia? This question made me laugh. Mainly because I've lived in a lot of different states, including Arizona and Oklahoma. I must say, Oklahoma humidity is literally disgusting. I feel like I'm breathing pudding. It's horrid. And the heat on top of that, definitely know how it feels to be in humidity. Arizona, dry heat. I honestly feel like dry heat is worse than humidity. I know a lot of people have like different opinions on that, but dry heat hurts. Humidity, yeah, it's hard to breathe. I would rather have humidity than dry heat. Arizona was literally the worst place I've ever lived in my life. Why do I keep talking with my hand? Like, stop. Arizona in the summer 
almost every single day was like 112 degrees. I was out in that every single day because I went to college and I had to ride buses and stuff. I think I'll be okay. I definitely hate the heat. I'm hoping it's worth it. Are you leaving on bad terms? Absolutely not. I'm actually leaving on really, really, really good terms, which I'm very happy about. Where are you moving to? I'm going to be moving to Florida, which is ironic because I was born in Florida and I lived there for like two years when I was a little, 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 little baby. So I don't remember anything about it. And then I lived in California and I grew up there for 17 years. Then I moved to Oklahoma. Then I moved to Arizona and then I'm in Virginia and I'm going back to Florida. I wonder if this is like... A big old circle and that's where I'm gonna stay I don't know I guess we'll see is crystal showing any signs of sadness that you're moving away from her yes a lot of signs of sadness but so am I because it's a hard change crystal and I were together 24 7 for almost four years it's almost like I'm being ripped from her life we'll text we'll FaceTime we'll talk on Facebook we'll do whatever it takes to continue our friendship and I must say this might be a little weird for some people. For me, it was a little weird, but I'm grateful for this. Crystal and Destiny are actually friends. They talk, they text, they're friends on Facebook. And I think it's kind of neat because it makes things a little easier for me. Where will you live when you move? Destiny and I are getting our own place. It's just gonna be me and her. We're gonna have to pay our own bills, buy our own food. This is something neither of us has ever done before. My whole life I've relied on other people, especially being in foster care. That is how I grew up. I'm used to other people taking care of me and now it's finally my turn to take care of myself. Do you have any family where you're moving? Negative, zero family. Are you scared to move? Yes, I am. Do you like change? If the change is good, if the change is positive, of course. Are you taking any of the animals? I want to take Charlie so bad. Charlie is my life. You guys know this. I can't take him though. I can't take any of the animals. It's really hard for me. There is going to be a lot of tears. There already has been a lot of tears. These animals are like my children. Charlie even more so. I don't know what I'm going to do without him. It's going to be very, very hard for me. Do you feel like you moved on too soon after Crystal? No, I do not. I feel like everything happens for a reason. I'm a firm believer in that. I wasn't looking for love. I wasn't looking for someone to like hook up with. I wasn't looking for any of that. I purely downloaded the app because I wanted a friend. I wanted someone to talk to. I feel like love finds you when you least expect it. And I know it's so weird. I don't expect anyone to understand this. I don't think this would have happened with anybody else. Destiny just, I don't know. It's such a weird feeling. She just like came in, swooped me up and bam, like, and I did the same for her. And I need to admit it feels really good. And I really believe this has happened for a reason. What does Crystal think of you being with someone else? She's friends with her. She really likes Destiny as a person from what I understand. It's not up to Crystal if I'm with someone else and if she was with someone else that's not it's not up to me. I mean we're not together we're just friends. She's happy for me. She's sad though. There's just a lot of emotions around the whole situation. Are you moving in with your new girlfriend? Yes she's not my girlfriend yet though but she will be. <laughs> I saw on Instagram that your new girlfriend just got out of a serious relationship as well. Does this worry you or her. It does not worry her at all. She's never brought that up at all. But I bring it up a lot that it does worry me. But she feels exactly how I feel. Like she feels like we were drawn to each other. I know a lot of people don't believe the universe like really connecting two people together. I believe in that so much and so does she. That's just us. Are you moving because you met someone else? I don't feel like I'd be moving if I didn't meet Destiny. No. So you're right. I am moving because I met someone else. There's a big chunk of me that feels like I also need to move on. So this is a great opportunity to do so. Will you still be vlogging with this new person in your life when you move? Destiny loves that I make YouTube videos and she's watching it right now. So hello. <laughs> I'm very shy to vlog in front of other people, but I'm going to try my hardest to continue vlogging as long as I have this phone because that is what I vlog with my cell phone because it's just easier for me. Destiny is actually going to be in the vlog. She actually wants to be in them. It's definitely going to be different for me because Crystal was the opposite. She didn't even want to be a part of it at all because she's shy, which is understandable. 
Did you save money to move? I'm trying my hardest to save whatever money that I am receiving, whether it be from YouTube videos or this or that. Destiny is also saving and she has a job, so it's easier for her. Do you feel guilty leaving Crystal's family? There was a lot of guilt. Before I told them, my stomach was in knots every single day. I just felt really bad for some reason. I explained that to them, like I felt guilty, I felt bad, and they literally looked at me in confusion. They didn't understand why I felt that way. What if it doesn't work out with your new girlfriend? Well, if it didn't work out with me and Destiny, I'm sure I would figure something out. Crystal's already told me that she would want me to come back here. I have high hopes for me and Destiny. We do have a really strong connection. I just, I really do feel like this is gonna work. I don't wanna ever have any doubt in my head. I like positivity, not negativity. What are you going to do about money? Destiny has a job, so she has money. I have a little income coming in from YouTube and just random things like that. I will be applying for tons of jobs as soon as I move to Florida so you guys don't have to worry about that. Did you and Crystal start talking to new people before you broke up? No. Neither of us talked to new people before we broke up. We were both very faithful in our relationship which is how you should be. There you guys go! I answered every single one of your questions. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you in my next video. Bye!